it's Laura. About two months ago, I was admitted into the hospital and become totally paralyzed on the right side of my body, and I was diagnosed with MS. MS really stinks. My own immune system is attacking the myelin sheath that protects my nerves. The damage is in my brain and spine. Well, I don't have time for MS. I have an awesome husband, sweet, sweet kids that I can't get enough of. And I have my dream job where I get to use my passion for music and my love for people and put it all together and serve the body of Christ. So here's what I did. I hopped on a plane with my dad and went to Chicago and visited Northwestern Memorial Hospital where Dr. Burke and his amazing team have found a way to halt the progression of multiple sclerosis. And I have been accepted into the study. I'm so excited. Since I'm not a doctor and I'm not very good at science, I'm going to give you a very unscientific explanation of what they're going to do in Chicago. First, they'll take my stem cells and they'll only keep the babies. Then, they'll wipe out my immune system with a heavy regimen of chemotherapy. I'll get my stem cells back and we'll restart my immune system from the ground up. This will mean that my body has no memory of how it attacked itself. My MRI from Chicago showed not only growth in the lesion that caused my paralysis, but a new lesion here on the pons. The pons is important because anytime you chew, swallow, breathe, and sleep, you are using it. It also plays a role in hearing. She's pretty attached to her pawns. Yes, I am. And to keep the attack from getting any worse or to prevent further attacks, I'm on IV steroids for the next few days, and then I'll be on an oral steroid taper for about 15 days. The doctors in Chicago and my doctor here in Austin are urging me to move forward with the procedure as soon as possible. We're having insurance look into covering it, and because it's a study, it's 50-50. So we're trying to raise some money to help out in the eventuality that it might not be covered by insurance. The number that the hospital gave us today is $125,000. I know, we're probably going to need to rob a bank. But actually, I have great faith that the Lord is gonna do a great work here today. And I've been encouraged to send a video out to tell some family and friends about what's going on and to share the need. The first thing I wanna do is say a huge thank you to everyone. There are way too many people to name and thank, but we are so grateful. We feel so supported by our friends and family and church family. We've been fed and loved and visited and thank you so much. A lot of people are asking what else we need, and right now what we need most of all is prayer. If you would pray first that our insurance company would cover most part or all of the treatment, it would be incredible. And if God puts it on your heart and you are able to help in any way, we would appreciate your financial support. But we covet your friendship and your love most of all. 